Hello guys, welcome to the next lecture on the GATE 2024 Mathematics. Today I will explain you the questions related to the outward flux problem. Before that you can simply see my playlist GATE Mathematics under the channel name Dr. Harish Gar, and you can find the various lectures on the GATE 2024 Mathematics. Now it is an outward flux. So how you can find the flux is that is a F dot ds. Now since F is given to you I can change into the divergence theorem. So del gradient of this of the volume fine so what is the divergence of the f you can see i can take the partial derivative with respect to x partial with respect to y partial with respect to z so i can add them so it will be 3 x square plus y square plus z square so x square plus y square plus z square over the volume fine now how you can integrate them either you can take the limits otherwise change into the spherical polar coordinates so what are the limits of these spherical polar coordinates? I can write it directly here. This is the triple integration. It is 3 r square. What is the dx dy dz? It is r square sin phi dr d theta and d phi. And I think you all of you know what is the polar, what is the polar coordinates, spherical polar coordinates are r sin phi cos theta y is equal to r sin phi sin theta and z is equal to r cos phi such that the jacobian of this that is this will be r square sin phi dr d theta and d of phi and the limits are radius is because the maximum radius is 1 and it's a complete closed sphere so it is a angle is from 0 to pi theta is by here now you can integrate them it's a 3 is outside r square that is r raised to power 4 so it's a r raised to power 5 over 5 from 0 to 1 sine this limit is my theta this is outside is my phi so minus cos phi from 0 to pi there is no theta so we can write like here now you can solve this it's a 3 over 5 it's a minus minus plus 1 minus minus plus 1 it is my 2 pi so it is 3, 6, 12 over pi, 5, pi is there. So now what is the alpha? 2.4 is the right answer of this problem. You can see with the help of the spherical polar coordinate, you can easily change into them. We will see the next lecture on the green theorems and the other ones. Till then, you can simply like, share and comment on my videos. Best of luck students. Happy learning.